Look at this dude. Good morning. Welcome back to my vlog. Um, welcome if you're new, Piriku. If you don't know, my name is Diamond. And welcome back to my channel. Um, today I'm basically doing a day in the life of me. Um, so today we do our practice. It's currently 5.38 a.m. Um, I'm getting a little better at waking up. So like this is why I am doing it and I am talking. If you haven't seen my past videos, go check those out if you haven't watched them already. Um, if you've seen my past videos, it's really it's been really hard for me to wake up these past days. Um, but it is 5.38 a.m. and we do and I'm currently getting ready for practice. After practice, me and Dell are going to go to um, just gonna go stay on campus because I have two classes today. Well, actually, I have three classes today because today is Wednesday, um, August 30th. I do have three classes today. I have two classes in the morning and I have a class at 4 p.m., which is only 30 minutes long. So it's really just like I have two classes. But all of my classes today are really, are really, really short. Um, they're just, um, I would, they're not lecture classes or something else. I don't know what they're called. But um, yeah, so I'm currently getting ready. Um, well, I'm going to start getting ready for uh, practice. Practice is going to be there at 6.20. It's 5.40. So I am going to rush a little bit to get ready because I do need to pack my school clothes, my school backpack, as well as my chair backpack, and put my chair clothes on. And I need to figure out what I'm going to wear to school today. Because I'm the type of person that cannot go to school in my chair clothes. I don't know why, but to be productive and do things in my life, I literally have to, like, feel like I'm ready, you know? So... That is what I'm gonna do. But yeah, so I'm currently gonna wash my face, brush my teeth, I have to make up my bed and pack all my bags for today. And basically, you know, just get ready for my entire day at five in the morning. So, <laughs> I do have a haul that I wanna show you guys really quickly. Um, La Roche Posay, if you guys don't know what that is, it's a skincare brand. They sent me a bunch of products, so I'm gonna show you guys what I got. Um, so first I got this um, Purify, I've already opened the whole box. Just don't talk about it. Uh, Cause I was so excited to like, when I saw the box, I was like, I, I gotta open it right now. So this is not an unboxing, but this is a haul of everything that I did get. So first I did get their uh, purifying foaming cleanser. Comes like this. Oh my God, guys. And it's so good. I've used it for the past three days. And look at my skin. I mean, I do have a pimple over here somewhere, but that's fine. Um, so yeah, I have the purifying cleanser. It is for normal to oily skin. Next, I do have the uh, Daily Repair Moisturizing Lotion. Um, next, they sent me other cleans uh, not cleansers, uh, other moisturizers. They sent me the Double Repair Matte Moisturizer, the Double Repair Face Moisturizer that does have um, SPF, which is uh, SPF 30, uh, so sunscreen. And then last, they sent me a Daily Lotion Sunscreen that has SPF 70. And then um, the two other things they did send me are... Um, I think this is the hyaluronic acid acid serum, the B5. Um, it looks like this, and then that, and then they also sent me the uh, vitamin C drops as well. I just want to show you guys um, this uh, teeth whitening brand that that is now uh, sponsored by Cheer here at Tech. Um, I'm pretty sure they are called Opalis. I'm not completely sure, but I'll put the name on the screen. <laughs> um, but yeah, this is a teeth whitening brand. So basically, they like have like a whole box of teeth whitenings, right? And like you can literally pull them out and they literally come like this. I actually used one um, recently as in yesterday. And these are my teeth. And then it also they also gave us this uh, sensitive relief uh, cool mint toothpaste. And it's so good. Guys, I literally love it. But I'm going to start out with my regular toothpaste and then go in with that whitening toothpaste.
Okay, so today we wear black for practice. And I'm so excited that Bruce does tell us, like, the day before that, like, like, what practice are we wearing? Because I be forgetting. So today we wear our black. And look how cute she is, guys. I freaking love this practice for set. And it's so comfy. But it, it, it oh, dang it. It is, dude. I just love my shorts. Oh, my sneaker, I just brushed my teeth. That's okay. I'm gonna change, get ready. I have stuff to make my bed, and then I just pack on my bags. So I'm in a little bit of a rush. Brucey's here. <laughs> oh, look at everyone. Looks. <laughs> Raccoon Texas. Good morning. Good morning. Guys, I actually woke up on the right side of the bed today. Do you see the dead rat over there? No, I, I, I wasn't trying to. <laughs> I wasn't. Mm, mm. There's a dead rat in the corner. Good morning. It's me. <laughs> it's me, actually. Hi, child. <laughs> So are you recording? Yeah, you can see yourself. Wait. <laughs> Good morning, Pepe. Morning. <laughs> morning. Look at the field. <laughs> Mother! Until you heard me. You can't even hands the friends because I'm so tall. I'm just like this. Mother! Mother! All right. The shotgun of a Celsius in the morning is crazy. It's 6.21. Good morning. Good morning. Oh. Your heart is really good. Oh, oh, okay. <laughs> hey guys, so we just got to practice. So we're gonna get ready to go to school or go to the library and I need to change. My calves are literally taped. <laughs> my calves are on fire. Look at my roomie. Guys, me and my roomie, we smacked. Hell yeah. Smacked a full twisting rewind. As we should. There's still room for improvement though. Always room for improvement, but you know, we did smack one together. But yeah, I'm gonna go to the library to get some. I have class at 9.30. I'm really debating about taking my camera to class today. Do it. I'm kind of want to, but I feel like people are gonna look at me crazy. <laughs> crazy. I just like subscribe. Subscribe to my channel. <laughs> Get a grip. Y'all like my bun? Yes. No. You like my voice? It's my bun. It's oh. like ballet it's like bun, like this, like this. I love it. <laughs> Guys. So basically, all we did our practice was game day stunts. Um. Game day stunts, we did one and ones, we did uh, A frames, we did Elite, we didn't do baskets, and I'm so excited to do baskets tomorrow. Welcome, Texas Tech. Tomorrow. Yeah, we're doing baskets, we're doing the full we game. Have, we have practice tomorrow? 
what he just said. Oh, in the evening? 6.45, yeah, p.m. <laughs> Ew. Get a grip. So we're me and Della are in the library. We both have class at 10. We got our acai bowls, almost custom. Um, they barely gave me any strawberries and they charged me 10 bucks. I asked for extra granola and he added two. Two pieces of granola. So. And I'm I, sure he charged me because this acai bowl was $10. Yeah, they did charge you because it's actually supposed to be six. Four? They charged me $4 for a scoop of strawberries. And I asked for more honey. Man, I can't, I can't do this no more. Guys, doesn't this look like something you would see in a scary movie? I swear it does. Because when you're here late at night and you're here all day, you get scared. Hang on. Like I'm asking for attention. I have my bow in and everything. I can't believe I paid 10 bucks. I would have rather gone to the fertility bowl and actually got full off my bowl. Mm -hmm. That's what I was thinking. Hey, hey guys. So I'm walking. I just left Dale. It's 9.38. Um, I have class at 10. So I have class from 10.50 to 11. Oh wait, no, 10. 10 to 10.50 and then 11 to 11.50 is my second class. And then my class later is 4 to 4.50. So all my classes are pretty short, but they are accelerated. So that means the teacher does talk very fast, which means I gotta take notes very quick. My hand be moving in class, but then start walking to class. I have a seven to eight minute walk, and every time I go to this math class, there's never seats. So I'm trying to get there early so I can actually get a seat in class. Okay, well, I just got out of class, and actually both my classes, I for, I didn't record in either one because one, I had a mental breakdown in both of my classes because they're both my math classes. I didn't know what I was doing in class. Couldn't help myself. So currently, currently walking home, and I don't like this. People are staring at, staring at me with a camera, so hold on. Okay guys, so I'm back home and I'm not gonna lie, I tried to do schoolwork. Like I tried to do my math, cause I like, when I tell you guys, like this is like real talk, like I'm not even gonna lie. So I was in my math class, the class was contempt math. If you know anything about content math, there's no numbers, it's all letters. So we're dealing with T, F, P, Q, R, and M. Be so absolutely freaking for real. So I'm in the class, right? And when I tell you, she was zooming through those slides. Math is like, and like it's, I'm good with numbers. Like I, I know that for a fact. Um, but when it came to all of the letters that she was pr pronouncing and putting out, I got lost. And she was zooming so fast that people were like, we were taking notes and like, I'm like, I'm not the only one. Cause like the girl sitting next to me, she didn't know what like was going on either. Right? So we're in class trying to like take pictures and zoom through the notes. Can't not even listening to her because I'm trying to take the god dang notes cause she's zooming so freaking fast. I don't even know why you're going that fast. Um, it's a math class. But everyone in the class seemed to freaking get it. Like people, she was like, Okay, so the answer to this is what? Class was like T. What's the answer to this? F. What's the answer to this? R. I'm not getting a single piece of information when I tell you I was sitting there 
having a mental breakdown internally. And like, and then she was like, um, break off into like, get a partner and work on this graph or whatever, da 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 da, table. Figure it out yourself. And we'll go over it after. As soon as she says that, I wish you guys knew how many people was like, like, that was sitting near me and was like, what are we supposed to do? I was in that caliber. Like, I didn't know what the freak to do. And I'm sitting there in glass and I'm, and she's like, so you guys get it? Yeah, yeah. And like, did, like no one, it didn't even give us a chance to respond. First of all, I'm the type of person in class that's like, yes, I need to ask questions um, when I when I get um, stuck and like don't comprehend. But I also don't want to slow the entire class down because like half the class seemed like they got it and half the class seemed like they didn't. And people were like, and people, no one wanted to speak up and be like they didn't get it and i'm not the person to speak up especially in a class of 300 people like i'm just not going to i'm very much antisocial, very much to myself like i don't do that like I spe like especially when there's people around that i do not know like i'm very much antisocial. and when she was like did everyone get it i i was still writing notes so, like i obviously didn't hear it for real and to raise my hand and be like hey I actually don't get it. So yeah, um, so next I went to my developmental math class because I couldn't pass this freaking TSI. It's like a special class that's for your math class. So like this, like I'm in this developmental math for my content math. And so like I was in there and she was explaining it and I was like, I still don't get it. Like, and people in the class were like, they got it. Like third day of having this class and I'm already lost. And when I tell you guys, I had a mental, I literally had to walk out of like the developmental math class because I genuinely had a mental breakdown. I started crying. I couldn't do it. I couldn't figure it out. I know I'm not stupid and I know I'm not dumb. I just need someone to like teach me one-on-one. -on -one. So to uh, make up for that, uh, I actually got a tutor. Um, so while I was having a mental breakdown, um, I ended up just calling the tutoring center. I was like, hey, since I do get free tutoring, might as well use it. So I called them and I was like, hey, can I get a tutor for content math? She was like, yeah, totally. Guys, I got a math tutor. We scrape now, we scrape. It's been a long, long day. I do have a intro to human science class at four. So I am currently doing my anatomy class since it is online. I'm in anatomy two. Uh, finally get to get anatomy over with after the semester. Del just went off and went to school because um, she has an actual class at like 2. We never see each other. Be like when we do it's at practice or things of that nature. But that's completely fine because we meet up with each other at night time. And we get to talk about our day. And that's probably the best part of my day. And know that I'm not alone and struggling in school. So if you are struggling in school and you want advice or help with anything... I am always here. My DMs are always open. The comment section is always open for anything you guys want to talk about. The struggle is real. So for my freshmen that are going through it, I guarantee you, you're not alone. Sophomores, um, you may or may not be going through it. The class may be hard. You're still getting um, past your um, basics of college before you transfer to your profession. Um, but I'm a junior and I'm still struggling, so... I do the accelerated nursing track next year and I'm so excited. I started in the summer. That was my little TED talk for this little section of the video. Um, I am gonna finish out doing some anatomy. Um, I'm pro I'm very hungry. I still haven't eaten. The only thing I had today was at acai bowl at like nine this morning. Um, it is the, almost two o'clock and I still haven't eaten anything else. Not gonna lie that acai bowl really messed up my stomach so she was in pain. In my class, I need to reset my life. I need to do a Sunday reset because I am struggling. Uh, and I did end up walking home because I did have a mental breakdown after my developmental math class. So I ended up taking a 25 to 30 minute walk home. I, I am a student athlete that does work. So if you guys have any questions on that and how to manage it, I am new. Actually, I'm not really new to it, but because I did it last year for when I was at the Valley, if you do know me from then. Um, but yeah, if you have any questions on that, I can answer them in the future. I'm going to finish up my lecture notes and stuff because I do have anatomy homework due on the 1st, which is in two days. So got to get all my notes done so I can <laughs> use them on our open note quizzes. If I gotta get a tutor, I'm gonna get a tutor. And the only reason I said it is because we get free tutoring here. So it's very much later. And I'm currently going to my third and final class of the day. 
I did change shirts and I just grabbed the jacket because I literally couldn't do the long sleeve shirts. So I have a short sleeve shirt and I just grabbed the jacket. Because I wasn't doing it. But I am. I'm, I'm driving close to campus so I don't have to walk as far. But I'm still getting my steps in. So I do have my backpack and then, like I said earlier, I am going to tutoring after because your girl needs it. So, yeah. And I have my beats on my neck because I hate when people try to talk to me on the way to class. That's the tea on that. So I do have my jacket. I do need my wallet. And I'm pretty much ready for school again. Which means I'm saving myself roughly around a 10 minute walk. Even though it's a 20 minute walk from my house, but I'm saving myself 10 minutes by just driving. Even though this is gas. Gas that I do not have. Um, literally my tank, my like, what is it called? Like your fuel light? I, like, yeah, yeah. Mine's on. Also, my camera's finna die, so I'm gonna update you guys in a bit. Guys, I am so happy I ended up going to tutoring because I literally know everything now. I'm already ahead. Um, she let me, or she helped me out with um, getting basically ahead in the class. And and then I went to um, human science class. And she, the teacher literally is so freaking nice. She's so sweet. And she literally was like, this will probably be the easiest class you'll ever take. And if you fail, well, basically you're dumb. You basically get a free hundred if you just show up to class. Yeah. So basically that concludes my de day in my school life. Um, thank you guys so much for watching. If you made it this far, give this video a thumbs up. Comment things you want to see in the future. Subscribe to my channel if you have not already. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Rackham, Texas Tech.